51-year-old Inn came across a most disturbing incident on Tuesday. While he got off a taxi in Yueyang of Hunan province, a young man got in and suddenly took out a handgun, holding it to the waist of the driver, who was surnamed Wang. I got off and he got in. I thought something was wrong and saw that he pointed the gun to the cab driver. The man asked Wang to take him to the provincial capital Changsha, and seeing that Wang was hesitating, the man began to become emotional. I've been driving a taxi for nine years and never experienced such an incident. I was so scared, he first held the gun at my waist, then pointed it to my head. Ian decided that he should help the driver. Soon he saw a policeman patrolling in the neighborhood. Ian said to me, come and rescue him. I had a terrible feeling. This man could open fire at any moment, and that's the most crowded area in the city. To reduce potential harm, Cao made a surprising decision. I said to the man, I'll take you to Changsha. I simply wanted to take him away from the crowd. The young man set Wang free and pointed his gun at Cao's head instead. And Cao didn't head to Changsha. He drove the taxi to the nearest police station and overpowered the gunman with three other colleagues. The man, surnamed Liu, was in his late twenties. He was found to be illusional after taking drugs. The police were already on the hunt for him as he had already hijacked another taxi earlier in the evening.